Okay. Good evening, dear friends all over the world. Good night. Good morning. Good afternoon to some of you according to your location on the face of this planet Earth. We welcome you all to our today's live broadcast right here from our homeland radio Biafra here in Biafra land where I am broadcasting from. Thank you for joining us. We move. Let us pray very fast. No much protocols. Then they send the Rosia. I never in our own language. Nareke le na road to na road to man rambili lo na richi si chine kembochi o men mo de warabo chine kende biafra chi aije mono chi na de abamu chi de uranye ndo mbo wali ne parakata ibi biani men kalani bure benani aihe ganu nareke le ni ingozi ki na road to ni ehu na anya gi na no ajija mma ni hi nchekwa gi imela na ka mo nda na kwande bia frata ai na abawanye wo obochi ihe a we di mmagi obu egum no bi ndo wa egum no bi hawo na obuda ga abu eba ga na acha na ma mi igbe gi ka odi otu obu ya mera ije buli ke lu na re ke le maka hi ja ipo bi eme na ro tutu maka hi di nam di ka na eme na no jija ma maka anyiji ESN na eme email ezu do maka radio biaf email a chineke maka ipo bi leadership na rekele maka ipo bi family members email a ezu do oji si na wo nigeria na ala email a eze mmeri na ihi ebere gi neba ino na rekele na rotutu na hagi chi uku okike abia amara pro ime ihenile we have prayed ise 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 thank you if you are ready to watch this very program you will know that you will be strong because the topic there facebook will not allow you they, you can see how they are moving people. Facebook will not allow you. Facebook will not allow you. They are removing people. What is the top? It is just a message. Why is Facebook afraid? Just a message. Message to Nigeria president. Baratinubu. And Ishetima. On free Namdekano. That is the topic. That's what I wrote there. Why is Facebook afraid of this? Why? Why is Facebook afraid? Why are they removing people? Because of the topic. Just a message. Or do they know what I want to say? Facebook, why? So they have just... Lorita Nochie, I don't think she's in power now. So they have just shared this very uh, program immediately. Reported it to Facebook to start removing people. To attack it. So if you are ready to watch this very program... You know that when you remove, they remove you, you come back. If they remove you, you come back. We are going to address them, right? That is the part. We don't have gun. We don't have a bomb. We don't have any weapon. This is our only means of fighting them. In line with self-determination. Under UN Charter of the Rights of Indigenous People, the same thing with the Nigerian Constitution. I am not with the gun here. I am only with the Biafra flag. Why are you afraid? Then we move. Free Nam De Khan unconditionally. IPOB awareness campaign. Do you see this very bad? We are already in. And we are already finishing. 
Nigeria have lost it totally. I am sending this message to those that was um, elected. Yes, if you was the one elected, go and be the president. How can condemned criminal uh, allow his vote to be counted? I am talking about Nigerian citizens. So you can see me write him. He is your president, Bola Medi If you are angry, go and remove him. Go and put yourself. When we told you, you didn't believe us. So he is a Nigerian president. Whether you like it or not. Right? This message goes to them. On Namdekano, because there is no case for Namdekano. If there is anything they discussed about Namdekano, they should know they have lost it. The, fed, the government of Buhari that took up this very battle with Namdekano and the IPOB have been defeated by IPOB and then they can. They have left office. Buhari died 20 something. The cabals, they led till 2023. They have left office. They didn't achieve it. They have nothing to say, this is what we achieved on Namdekano and IPOB. Rather, they restored Biafra. They helped us to restore Biafra. Now, what I am telling this new government is that there is no case for Namdekan and there is no trial for Namdekan. There will be no charges for Namdekan. There is no debt of court for Namdekan. Did you understand? Now, there is no detention warrant, that valid one, that guaranteed Namdekan's detention in DSS. Number one. That man we must know. This is not the kind we are talking. When we say he defeated the Buhari's government, I must have to pick it out one by one how he defeated them. Nandekanu was arrested or kidnapped or abducted in Matla Mohammed Airport, Lagos. October 14, 2015. We are sending this message to them. Facebook is tackling it. Now, they charge Namdekano for treason. Right? They took Namdekano to court. President Tinubu of Nigeria, this message is to you. Those that know them, and knows how to send it to them, she send it to them. Then share it because we know we are keeping records. We know we are keeping records and we know what we are doing. We know what we are doing. Now, Nigerian government took the case to the Court of Justice Ademola of the Federal High Court Abuja. Justice Ademola, in December 2015, released the Namdekan unconditionally. DSS rearrested him. I know why I'm telling this new government these things. Because there is no case for Namdekan. Nigeria have lost it all. But we are counting it. They rearrested Namdekan in DSS. So now that they left him and went to his home and rearrested him, in DSS, without obeying the court order, which immediately the order was given, the detention warrant becomes invalid. The detention warrant becomes invalid. There is no detention warrant that is keeping him because the very detention warrant that he was kept in detention with immediately had been unconditional release, it becomes null and void. But he was rearrested without court order in DSS. They detain him there. Without court order, they detain him based on the initial detention warrant that immediately Ademola discharged him 
unconditionally, that warrant becomes useless to detain him. But they use it to detain him. Now, we continued. We continued. They transferred the case to the court of Justice Johnson. Let's know because we never pick up arm. We never go in any violence. We didn't destroy anything. Listen to how we have been following Nigeria. For those of you who say, I feel me do this. I in 2021, 2022, you are dreaming, you are a fool. I am bringing the record to your doorstep. Because that thing IPOB did not do 2016, 2017. Oga, you are trying to target on IPOB now. You are dreaming. You are dreaming. This time around, we have every grant. A very legitimate grant, more than the other case. This one, extraordinary rendition. The other one, he just, um, they arrested him in Nigeria. Matla Mohamed Depot. This one, he was kidnapped in Kenya. We have a very good grant. Nothing will even take us to violence of any kind. But we have the right for self-defense. Are you aware? UN did not rule on the other one. UN have ruled on this. UN working group. What brought to the attention? A sudden rendition. It wasn't involved in the other case. 2015. Right? Then we move. He was taken to the court of John Soho at the end of the matter. John Soho, in the presence of Labaran, DSS prosecutor, Nandikano was discharged unconditionally by Honorable Justice John Soho. Right? I know why we are keeping the records. We know. Because this thing, all of them are rushing. IBOB, IBOB, okay? If we want to do something, we will do it in 2015. We will do it in 2016. We will do it in 2017. And the worst would have been when our leader was missing. He was missing. We didn't burn down Nigeria. Now you committed a standard rendition. You are concocting story. IPOB do this. IPOB do that. IPOB. We are bringing this to the notice of this new government to know that eh, only if they want to use these strategies of black men, that it is it will end up in the, it will, they will end up deceiving themselves because IPOB can never be defeated. The best is to free Namdekan because all these black men, the new world of black men, you know, against IPOB, cheap cheap blackmail, cannot do IPOB anything, cannot do Namdekan John Soros case court. The same warrant, detention warrant. That the, the same detention warrant that Justice Ademola decided Namdekano on, they took Namdekano to the court of John Soho. They are censoring the program to the court. They took Namdekano to the court of John Soho with the same detention warrant that have not been obeyed. The same detention warrant that have not been obeyed. In the court of Ademola, they use it to, to, to take Namdekanu to the court of John Soho. And the same warrant, John Soho discharged Namdekanu unconditionally. Nigerian government, under Buhari government, they use the same detention warrant that have become null and void two times from two courts. From the court of Justice Ademola, as he discharged Namdekanu unconditionally. John Soho discharged him unconditionally. The same warrant was the warrant they are using to transfer, which we know that that warrant ended that day. Ademola discharged him. Right? They are still using the same detention warrant because they did not go to any court and take any order to detain him. They used the same detention warrant after court free him. Right? I told people to be strong in this program because Facebook will deal with you. They are ready to deal with you. The right up there is a, they are panicking. But we move. I dwell here. Here, this analysis here. I dwell here. Eba, I know, Eba. Eba, I'm calm. We know why we are flowing it, line by line. Now, 
that the same invalid warrant, the same DSS, they disobeyed the court order of John Sogo, they moved the case again to the court of Justice, Honorable Justice Ahmed Mohammed. With which warrant? The same warrant that had been discharged in the court of Ademola. You know, what is keeping you in detention is the warrant. That warrant, what the court discharges is the warrant. What the court discharges is the warrant. How come Ademola discharged in on that very warrant? They held him back with the same warrant. They took him to court of John Soho with the same warrant that had become invalid. From the court of John Soho, they move him again with the same warrant. No new warrant from any court. Did you understand? To the court of Ahmed Mohammed. What did Ahmed Mohammed do? He, he said no. He did not rule on it. He said he won DSS from Sorry, he told DSS to, to go and obey the previous court rulings. Rulings. It has S. Why the rulings? The ruling of Justice Ademola and the ruling of Justice John Sogo. They are rulings that Ahmed Mohammed was telling DSS to go and obey. And now warned them. He now warned them from bringing such case in his honorable court. Right? Now, we continued. Share this program. It doesn't matter what Facebook is doing unless they don't allow people to share. Right? They're only showing me one person viewing. Not my business. Then we continue. They now took the case, a case that had been discharged unconditionally by two courts and the third court said that they should go and obey the previous court rulings which automatically is also discharged because Ahmed Mohammed's um, direction to DSS means discharge also. He's backing up the rulings of two courts. Right? He was backing up the rulings of two courts. Now, DSS moved the case to the court of Injustice Fatima Binta Motalanyako. She can never be had justice. Which kind of justice? You will see why she is not justice. Now, here we are now. You will know why Binta is never a justice, but an injustice. Other judges I called, I added honorable justice. But Binta Fatima Binta Motalanyako is an injustice. Right? We move. She can never be justice. If you add injustice, you are, you, are, you are just deceiving yourself. Here I am now. You, I will prove it to you. Now, 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 now. Why is she an injustice? Now, the court of Ademola is a federal high court. Are you aware? The court of John Soho, a federal high court. You are aware? The court of um, Ahmed Mohammed is a federal high court. All of them are sitting in Abuja. The court of injustice, Bintanyako, is a federal high court sitting in Abuja. How come... Two federal high courts decided in America unconditionally. The third one asked them to go and obey the previous court ruling, which are three discharges. How come Bintanyako Federal High Court, Abuja, now ended up in granting bail? Not even self bail, high conditional bail. High conditional bail, not self bail, you can sign and go. High conditional bail. On the same warrant that he kept moving, warrant that had been discharged in the court of Ademola, that there was no new warrant issued to help the Namdekan after that ruling. There was no new warrant. It was the same warrant they moved to John Sobo. The same warrant they moved to Ahmed Mohammed. The same warrant was the one they moved to the court of Bin Tanyako. The same warrant was the warrant Bin Tanyako granted high conditional bail. Three men were shot in. Not uh, just a man, not just men. Say one must be senator. The other one must be a Jewish rabbi. One, uh, Igbo business billionaire. And not that, uh, they have landed in Abuja. 
and they drop 100 million naira each. High conditional bail, it has not ended there, then he will not be in the midst of 10 people, more than 10 people. He will not address the press. High conditional bail on a, an invalid warrant that had been destroyed by the rulings of Ademola in December 2015. Bintanyak, your ruling took place in 2017. But in 2016, 2015, Ademola discharged that warrant. 2016, Joshua discharged the warrant. The same 2016, Ahmed Mohamed asked you to go and obey the previous court ruling. Now, in your own 2017, you gave that warrant bail. You granted it bail. That warrant, because the warrant is what represents an, an image. That warrant. That warrant represents you. The warrant is what they are judging on. That warrant, when you did not even come to court, they will go for bail. They will go for your court. It is that warrant that represents you. How come court disturbed that warrant? They are still using that warrant to be prosecuting in Namdi from court to court. If they say it is wrong, it is lie, then they should provide the new warrant that court issued to detain Namdi when Ademola discharged him, they should provide it. Is it not the same warrant? The same warrant that had been nullified by the ruling of the court. Immediately the unconditional release was being pronounced by the judge. That warrant became useless. Then but the DSS kept using it because there was no new warrant. It was the same warrant they used to transfer to Jonso, from Jonso to Ahmed Mohamed, from Ahmed Mohamed to Bin Tanyako. The same invalid warrant was what Bin Tanyako granted bail, high conditional bail. That's why she's in justice. Never add justice from her. Injustice, Fatima, Binta, Motala, Nyaku. Share it to, to the new government. I know why I'm cutting it. You know, they have, they, they, there was a file federal government left for them. The warrant already they gave to you. The warrant is useless. After appeal court ruling, right? Now the case file, there is no case file, it is an empty case file, it has been discharged. I know why I am, I start from back, so that you cannot be boasting, I'm a new government, nobody has power on Nam the Kano. IPOB does not beg any government, we are standing on court order, court order, we don't beg, people may expect us to beg somebody, we don't care, we don't have issue with an individual, we have case with the Nigerian government. They have choose a place to fight this battle. They brought, provided playground. They provided battleground. They prepared it. They set up everything. We came and defeated them. Why do they say they don't agree? So nobody in mind should think that IPMU now, uh, Tinubu is now a power. Nobody has power in the case of Onam Dekano. He has been discharged and acquitted. So you are holding empty case file. Do not boast with it. Nobody should say, I am in power. I have something to do on the camera. Nobody has power. Why I started afresh is for you to stop to um, stop that new blackmailing of IPOB because if IPOB will go into violence, it is not now that Nigeria is guilty of a extraordinary rendition. It's not now that we will jail Nigerian um, government officials that was involved in the kidnapping of Funam It is not now that the UN ruled on the case of Funam It is not now that we will go violence. But we have the right for self-defense. But what we are telling you is that had it been we want to go violence, it was in this previous, during this court rulings I am counting now, it was when we would have go into serious battle. So this black man now is useless because it will harm nothing. It will harm nothing. It will end up nothing. And the Namdekan was freed. Now we continue. Being Tanya granted the Namdekan bell, we accepted, and um, what is it called? Met up with all the bear condition. Because Nigeria granted the Namdekan bell, out of their wickedness, the bare condition they gave to Namdekano was also holding Nigeria down. 
And they don't even want to allow it to happen in their court. It was among what warranted them to go and attack Namikano South. I will pick that only one point and tell you that it destroyed the Nigerian. And they have no ground to allow Namdekano to appear in Bin Tanyako's court. You know, Bin Tanyako failed in that court. Fulani just wrote um, bail condition and gave to her. Without knowing that, Nigeria have tied themselves in that bail, high conditional bail. One point I am picking out there, he will not be in the midst of more than 10 people. And in their plan, they know he will be coming to court. And if he come to court, right, you have the judge, if not a judge yourself, you have two judges. Uh, let me just mention one judge. You have the judge security. You have the court clerk. How many now? Then you have Namdekano's um, family, right? They have the right to be in the court. You now have DSS there, isn't it? You have federal counsel prosecutor. Isn't it? You have observers, right? How many are now? Are they now? Uh, uh, are they not all more than 10? Right? Then Nandekano's lawyers, they will be in the court. Isn't it? Have you not gotten more than 10 people? Now, in the midst of more than 10 people, if federal government bring Nandekano inside the court, because DSS will bring him inside the court, how many DSS will be holding him and bring him inside the court? If there are not much, two people will bring him inside the court. Isn't it? Now, in that court, have you not gotten more than 10 people? If Nigeria are bringing Namdekano inside the court, where more than 10 people are, what will be the case? Content of court. Now you know. You know why they, how they change themselves. You see, now you understand. Now you know part of the reasons why his house was attacked. Because they changed themselves in desperation to tie Namdekanu down. They tied themselves down. Namdekanu was very, very proud, telling them in Ohafia that he is going to their court and he is coming back with the head of Buhari, as simple as that. And we know that he will scatter the court. How? Immediately he come inside the court where you see more than 10 people. Namdekanu will scatter that court. He will harass the judge and ask them how many people are here. And he will charge now. You will see his voice now. You will hear him. Nigeria will be guilty of content of court. Now you know why they were running away from their court. Now you know why Bin Tanyako refused to present that warrant after his house was attacked. Right? Bin Tanyako ran away from that case. He kept shouting, bringing down the county to court. Bringing down the county to court. The same man the county you granted bail. You did not ask who sent Tammy to his house. You didn't ask. Why was the house was attacked? You didn't ask because it was in line with the bail condition. Bin Tanyako was aware that after the bail had been granted, that the American would be killed. That's what they planned in his house. Bin Tanyako was fully aware. That's why when it fell, Bin Tanyako refused to hear our suit fight against the attack on the American house. Even when Barrister Jofo came to explain to the court in 2019, Bill Tanyako threw away our this thing, our application, threw it away. Bill Tanyako don't want to hear. Bill Tanyako, injustice Bill Tanyako, created ground for terrorists, Miet Allah, to be harassing any in Abaribe. Every time, Abaribe should be arrested to provide an American. Who created the grant, Ben Tanyako? How? For refusing to call Nigerian army to come and explain what they went to Namikano South to do. On that, Ben Tanyako created grant for Joy Bogwe to be attacking Abaribe, demanding that he should be arrested. Ben Tanyako is an injustice. Now we ask you, Ben Tanyako. I think the new government, you are listening. If you like, you listen. If you like, you don't listen. The message must be passed uh, for you to know we are keeping records, not to go and open book or exercise book where we wrote it. No, no. This is why you cannot defeat us. We, pre we are prepared very, very well. Uh, am I looking at any book? Book. Even if you look book, sometimes you waste time 
you waste time because your eye may shift. You waste time to to watch where you have uh, you have failed at least where you are making mistake. You know, uh -huh. if you look, watch like this, if you look the book to read again, you can even fail. Right? Now, reaching to 2021. Now, let me not move there. Let me still dwell on the attack on the Namdekano's house in Afaruku. When Namdekano was missing, 2018, did IPOB go to war? No. From 2017 to 2018, did we go to war? No. I know why I'm asking this because if you see them now, gather two people, uh, some rat, they will tell you, we are ESN. Uh, I, I was forced to join ESN. I, I, we are asking you, did IPOB in the normal position they are supposed to fight when our leader was missing? We don't know where he was. The leadership did not tell us. Was it not when the governors would have been sacked, would have been pursued, or pushed away from our land? Did we do anything? Did we do anything? So if you are raising up black men, I feel we do this, I feel we do that, you are dreaming. Right? We move. Nam the Kano, this second one. Thank you. This very second one. He was kidnapped in Kenya. He was tortured in Kenya and was extraordinarily renditioned into Nigeria. Now, when Nigeria was addressing the world, they said that he jumped bail, that they kidnapped him so that he come and face his trial. Are you aware? Now, you go to the churches, both five charges, seven amended count charges, 15 amended count charges, you will not hear the cases of 2015 to 2017. It was a new, brand new warrant. Do you know why they kept the old warrant back? Because when you bring that warrant that he was granted bail on, the barristers the, the issue of jumping bell will come up. The issue of jumping bell will come up. When they come up, we will now go back to the attack in his house, freshly. Did you understand? Now, they planned it now that Bintanyako should ignore the initial warrant. And they provide new warrant. New, new amended can charges, they provided it. Now, in those amended can charges, those charges of 2015 are not there. The only thing that came there is transmitter issue that happened, a container of transmitter that DSS took in here. That's all. Every other charges are from 2015, 20, uh, 2018 to 2021, 2018 to 2021. That is to say, they did not include it. And that warrant have been kept aside. They came up with new warrant thinking that this one, they will use it to jail in America, and SARS, unknown government, all those rubbish, right? Election boycott. That's what they added in the charges. That's what they provided against in America, and SARS, all those things. Now, it was nearly, they would have added, added COVID-19 in the charges that in America caused COVID-19 in Nigeria, right? The Americano brought COVID-19. That's what the, the only thing they did not add in these charges. Only COVID-19. Every other thing that happened in Nigeria, both to army, kill people, they added to them. Right? Everything, both born attack on police station, even if it happened in Ugu State, they added it in the charges against the Namdekan. Because NSAS started in Ugu, ended up in Lagos, but they added it on the Namdekan. They say he attacked, um, he ordered to people to attack transport company Lagos. Right? Now, let us continue. I have touched the past. 
this message is to the new government. Nigerians, are you angry that you have a new president? He is your president. Bola Ahmed Tunubu and Shitima is your president and vice. You cannot do anything. Right? If there was anybody that won the election, let him be president now. Stop deceiving yourself. Right? Because you know what is good, you refuse to do it. So, who do you want to miss it for you? They are your presidents, after all. You don't do anything. You got an Now, this 2021, they kidnapped and they come. They told the world he jumped there. We went to Umai and destroyed it. Umai, verdict, 19th of January 2022. Ruled that an did not jump in, but he escaped military assassination attempt. One, that one is gone. UN brought order that an Namdekan should be released. Two, I know why I'm counting. You know. Nobody should say, nah, but the local government, he, not, he has something to do on Namdekan. Nobody have anything to do on Namdekan's case. That's why we thank God. Because he had been discharged and acquitted and prohibited from standing any trial in any Nigerian court. Very dangerous ruling. As he stands now, Namdekan is done tamper. Nobody should touch him. That's why we say we don't want surgery. He stands done tamper. Don't tamper. Which court gave order for operation? You should go and meet a big court that is telling him, can tell him that he's still in DSS. So that he want to undergo surgery. Go and bring, go, go to the, the same judges. So. Go and tell them that Namdekan want to uh, undergo surgery. So they should permit it in illegal detention. In illegal detention, not a convict. Not condemned criminal sees, not life, life imprisonment. Awaiting trial. If he's awaiting trial, he'll be granted bail. He'll be granted bail to go and take his medication. That's the highest reason to free an inmate. Health condition. But on this of Namdekan, he has been discharged and acquitted. And people are approaching for oppression. Very dangerous operation on a freed man. Is a name I hear. Half of Nigeria can have boy. Have boy in Akan. He told me for Cable Gitagia. Can I get a laugh free? And no back. And a land is all right. My brother, see, gave him one leggy. Now, happen one leggy now. Now, one leggy, they went to save his life. I got his seven day, my kind of no, but no, but I know one day. I got her safe where I'm here. No, 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 that's what they would tell us. Happy, I call on do good, we are happy. Happy, I can have where which God will permit them to kill him. Matthew, we move. I be caught in October, the starting of the camp, 13th of October. Condemned the way he was brought back to Nigeria. Asked Nigeria to pay him compensation. Told Nigeria not to try him before any court. Now, I know why I'm counting it. You know, people may be thinking that, uh, you know, I saw one body, there was somebody telling you, hey, this is Tinubu, is the Tinubu you are begging, the Tinubu you are begging to free Namdekan. No, who is begging Tinubu? We are telling Nigerian government to obey court order. You are the one who knows who is in power. What is our business? We base on court order. Is the constitution Tunibu is ruling with? Is it a different constitution? Is it not the constitution that instituted AP court, federal high court, state high court? So the constitution of Tinubu, the constitution Tinubu government is ruling with, does not establish, it does not uh, guarantee AP court. It does not allow, it does not, uh, um, 
accept to federal high court or supreme court or any let me not go to supreme they have not given their ruling on us state high court federal high court and appeal court so if this your constitution is backing these institutions up that is to say we don't have business with an individual we have business with the government who is keeping an American. it is your you that accepted a case that have been discharged under a frustrated government and you accepted it, you decide to be riding on it, to keep it with you, you are the one that is mistaken. Because there is nothing you will pick up from this case. So if there are people in Tinubu's cabinet waiting for IDW to come and beg them, you are dreaming. Nigerians can come and beg because of the dangers ahead. Those sensible Nigerians, they are talking to free them they can. But to insensible ones, they are clapping for his illegal detention. Now, his health condition worsens. They are rejoicing. They don't even know. It's just like somebody that is sitting down. You saw bomb coming to kill you. You are, you are clapping. Hey, this is a very beautiful bomb. Don't you know that where Namdekan is, is a problem to Nigeria? If you are a sensible Nigerian, you will tell any government, you will even approach this government and say, the other one have made mistake, free this man. After all, he's not facing trial, he's not standing trial, and will not stand trial. But as foolish as you are, you may be dancing. Hey, they are now asking Tinubu to free him. Tinubu wasn't there when he was discharged. He wasn't the president. We are not asking Tinubu to obey court order that was done in his house. No, that was given by uh, uh, by his uh, his daughter or his son. No, it was a judgment given by the Nigerian government. Hence, he occupies the seat of government. He will now carry the load because now they can defeat the Buhari government. As I have counted, I have mentioned there here in this broadcast from starting. There is no basis for continuous legal detention of Namdekan. And there is no basis for any plan to eliminate Namdekan. There is no basis because he cannot die in illegal detention and somebody will provide the grant to defense. There is no grant. He is not facing trial. There is no excuse. He is in illegal detention. It is in Namdekan that is challenging his illegal detention in Supreme Court. Nigeria did not take us to Supreme. Nigeria is on defense in Supreme. We are the people standing boldly in Supreme. So I don't know where they want to take Namdekanu to. He has no date of court. Then we ask you, do anybody planning or thinking that uh, Namdekan is now in their hand? He is not in the hand of an individual. Federal government of Nigeria have refused their own court order. And IPOB is demanding that court order should be obeyed, not in Ubu's order. Not in Tinubu's order, court order of Federal Republic of Nigeria, which the same constitution that established the court is the constitution Tinubu was sworn in with. So if you do not believe in that constitution, then a B court, um, Federal High Court, State High Court should be abolished so that we will know that his government have no court. As far as he inherits that very seat, therefore, Every other institution, he will also face anything that is coming out there. Right? Thank you. So I am just sending this message to them so that nobody should come and deceive them and say, You are now in power, you are now in charge. So you have grant. That's why I started from a demolished ruling today. today. IPOB have been patient. IPOB have been enduring. How many rulings did I count? None was obeyed. Do you know that from 2015 to 2017, it was one detention one that was used till 2017, from 2015, one detention one and one, which you know that immediately one court ruled on that detention one and discharged unconditionally. That warrant have become invalid because it will be signed and stamped and the ruling of the court will be written on it. 
discharged unconditionally. It will be written on it. The judge will sign it, stamp it, right? So even if you do not, you run away with the warranty, you did not take it to the judge. The pronouncement of the judge is there. It nullifies any warrant you are keeping. Then, but do you know that it, is same, it was the same warrant that they took Nandukanu to the court of Ademola with? Was the warrant, after Ademola discharged him, was the warrant they took to John Soho? An invalid warrant. On the same warrant, John Soho ruled on it. Discharged now unconditionally. It was the same warrant they moved to the court of Adem, um, Ahmed Mohammed. Who told them to go and obey the previous control? It they refused to they refuse and they move it to John uh, Bin Tanyaku. The same warrant was the warrant that Bin Tanyaku granted bail. I ask you, do you know that even the bail Bin Tanyaku granted all of them was illegal because he granted bail on an illegal detention warrant? Illegal one because judgment have been given already on that warrant. I have been in detention. I was discharged and acquitted. That my warrant was signed. The judgment was written on it. Pronouncement of the judge, discharged and acquitted, was written on it. On my warrant. You cannot use it to detain me. You must go and demand for another detention warrant, arrest warrant, from another court with a new warrant. Not on the same, that warrant cannot hold me. That is, I mean, New warrant, new case I committed. Not that case. You cannot prepare that case again for me. New case. You can bring another new warrant. Not on that one. You will allow me to go and enjoy that one. Then you can go and bring another. Right? Do you understand? If you have new warrant for me, you bring it when I was in detention. If you bring it, they will call me and ask me, but they will call me and ask me, they will notify me I have a warrant. If they want to do a secret the record of the prison, they will keep it. That day you want to go, or that day your jail has finished, if you are convicted, after they will remind you, they will now show you a new warrant. If the person is a convict, was a convict, he will now move to awaited trial. And start going court again, right? On that new warrant. So, if you did not provide a standing new warrant on a different case, not on that matter, because the next warrant you bring will not be on the same charges you prepared against him. Not the same. You talk another thing different. Do you understand? But they used the same warrant to be taken in Africa. Even the bail they granted to him was useless because that warrant already had become useless. It was the same warrant. They kept moving from court to court. If this court decided him, they will move it to the other court. If this court decided him, they will move it to the other court. The same warrant. Now you see the kind of Nigeria you say is your country. Now this time around, this new warrant they prepared have been destroyed in a peak court. Which warrant are you holding on the canoe with? Stay of execution that was granted by Malami um, Sharia judges in appeal was also unlawful because it wasn't lawful, it was unlawful. Because Sinan Bikanu was not allowed, have not been allowed to go and enjoy the Abiy Kotululu. Therefore, they are still keeping him with the same detention warrant that had been discharged by Abiy Court. It is when you allow him to go, you can go for state of execution. If they now rule a, on the favor of federal, favor of federal government, which is against an American, they will issue fresh warrant to arrest or to detain. That one now will become valid. But this one is that he have not left DSS. You now rule state of execution, state of execution, 
and the favor of federal government, they kept detaining him with the same warrant that had been ruled on in the appeal court. Now you know. Now you know where Nigeria has fell. Now you know why we are very, very calm. Because we know they have failed it. We know why we maintain our self-determination stand. Because our leader has never taught us how to be violent. Right? So what we are telling those that thinks, think that Nigeria belongs to them or they still have something to achieve in Nigeria, tell your government your new government, that there is nothing in that case. They already knew. But we know why we explain. Because if you know the danger ahead, you will know that you don't have any country. So if you think you can have country, it is your duty to campaign that court order should be obeyed. If this new government does not obey court order too, you are gone, all of you. You are gone. So, do you think it's an achievement to illegally detain an American that when you see we are, we are complaining about his health, you will be laughing, you will be clapping. He says he is now submissive to the government. But do you know that Nigeria at the end will be submissive to us? Are you aware? Now you, 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 you need to think that IPOB is not a political party. IPOB is not a club, social club, right? It's not a union. This is a movement. This is a movement. We don't give right. There is no right. No right. He says, hey, if I have wedding, this is my right. If you have, we don't do it here. What we do is on Ruby. Now you see why we are very, very strong. Because nobody will say, they did not give me my right. They did not do this. They did not pay me. They did not, we, we don't have, they did not pay me salary. Those languages are not in IPOB. But in Nigeria, those languages are there. And you cannot do, if you need salary, you cannot fight us without your salary. But IPOB does not receive salary. Therefore, we fight us. One, we don't have any other thing apart from Namdekan. And if you reason to this level, you will know that Namdekan should be free. We don't have anything. So if someone is thinking that tomorrow IPOB will go and rest, you are dreaming. We don't have anything. You took all. God gave us Namdekan and IPOB. So what else do we have? What are we going to stay and uh, nah, let us relax? Relax for what? Relax for what? What are we expecting? We have been military vice president, able to kill. What did he achieve? We have been civilian vice president, Ekweme. What did he achieve? Right? Uh -huh. So we are even minister on that, but we got to what of Fonago. Is it from Ami, but what? Dr. What of Fonago, information and culture minister. What did he give to us? Did he protect us? But did you not see Lai Muhammad, information and culture minister? Did you not see how he defended his people? Did you not see it? Now, do you know we have gotten senior president? This one now just like Ali is Hey, senior president, senior president. Hey, senior president. In fact, Zemurem have become senior president. They did not allow him as Obasanjo planned it. Small time, Adolfus Mwabara became senior president. Small time, he was impeached. Tribu Akadibo became senior president. Small time, it was um, Payos Anim. Anim Payos Anim. From there, he went to Ken on Naman. Do you see that the five states have ruled as senior president? So, can they point out one thing they provided? Their says no, nothing. We have seen IGO police all over from Nkano. Niger police, right? All of two of us. What did he brought, brought for us? Nothing. So when people are saying, "Now, nah, Niger police will come from Ibo," 
I don't police come from Ibo, Commissioner of Police Ibo, and Abia will come from where? From Fulani. And uh, what do you think? Commissioner of Poli Ijo Police, Police Ibo man, his police are terrorists, terrorists, 80% of terrorists. So you think that uh, if he's not a terrorist, he can lead terrorists. Hey, Ibo man will become IG. Oh, that we have seen all these things. It is useless. We have been uh, army chief, Ihejirika. Even though, um, meaning, uh, candidate. Right? From Bayes have become, we, we have, Jonathan has become president. Oh, God, there is, go to his place if he can provide anything. They will frustrate you. There is nothing for here. We do not belong here. We have been doing Nigeria. It was Nigeria that brought to Biafra war. It was Nigeria we went and discussed. They disagree with the Nigerians. Otuku went and discussed Nigeria in Abuliga, presided over by General Ankara, equivalent to restructuring, not to Biafra. We didn't go to Ghana to discuss Biafra. We went to Ghana and discussed restructuring. But how do they come, come back and start killing us for, destroy, for discussing success of Nigeria? Way forward of Nigeria. Way forward, though. We brought independence. We sponsored independence. How? Luis Otuku. Let Luis Ojuku, great man, Chileke Enjirego, AJ Defender, but he's financed the independence of Nigeria. Anthony Nahoro moved to motion, right? 1958. Now, Zeke started it. The father of Ojuku was financing Zeke. Are you aware? Zeke and his team, because British was in our section where money was coming out from. They do not allow them. Right? Now, after the independence, the artificial independence, Tafa Belowa was prime minister. Are you aware? Now, do you, are you, can you understand? I don't want to finish everything there, but election 1964, 1964-65, let me not just go there. They are all on my screen, but they will divert me. Let me move forward to the Nigeria we went to Ghana and discussed. That brought to Biafra genocide. Tell me what Ojuku went and discussed with Kowan in Ghana. Was it not one Nigerian? Why do they come back and disagree? <laughs> so somebody think that is a position for us. You are dreaming. I have mentioned to you what we have become in your government. But they told him not to bomb. Hey, he's, he's a, a, a attack against Boko Haram is attack against the North. Now you know that even if you are army chief, that Fulani will not allow you to do your work. Are you aware? Go and ask Onovo. Kenneth Onovo, or Emmanuel Onovo, I don't know his name. Onovo from Onkano, I could remember. I your police, I remember them. I know those uh, other people from the other side. Can remember them. Tafa Balogu, then Yuslin Smith, Yuslin Smith, under of us and those people I'm calling now. Yuslin Smith, Tafa Balogu. Yuslin Smith killed Masob members. He was the IG that ordered for the killings of Masobians. Yuslin Smith. Uh -huh. Ishimo Diary. Diary. Yeah. Uh, Ekehana. Yeah. National Diary in the, in the IPU. Right? Ebana <laughs> Jodi. I search a name with them. Thank you. No more children. So, can you understand that we have no position? Are you aware that Obioso was a was a Nigerian ambassador? He was an ambassador in Brazil. He was an ambassador in another. Was it uh, in US or in Canada? I don't know. Gonna ask Biafra if they benefit anything from them. Obvious. If he favored Biafra, he cannot be appointed on Hades. You know, you cannot be good and you be appointed from the if you cannot be good to us is a lie. Is a lie. You can never be in power. Even if you are told they will subdue you. If the people vote you in, they will subdue you. You can't do all your mind and you cannot say what you are saying. Because 
Your brothers cannot help you and fight. They need your position. That's the yeah. If you complain to your brother about your position, election you won, what Fulani is doing to you, he will be telling he will go and tell Fulani what you are how that you are complaining of. Do you know why he's telling Fulani? He won't to occupy your position. He cannot join your fight. Did you not see when Peter B come out? Those shouting about president presidency, those that killed call Python dance to kill us, that brought to the seven graveyards in Biafra land, and the killings of over 1,500 IPB family members by Nigerian army. That Igbo presidents, that Igbo presidents, when uh, Peter B came out, what did the say? Why do they not say we will die here? Did you not see that they believe in their interest? Now, they will mind. I told them that when you come out as an Igbo, everybody will mind his party. They will mind he was after what APC would do. They don't care about you. Those that belong to PDP, they are after what their PDP would do. They don't care about you. Peter B was on his own. These are people shouting Igbo presidents, Igbo presidents, Igbo. You know that they are very, very dangerous and very, very wicked. Do they support him? We don't support him, President. But we are telling you that if that is what they wanted, why do they not come out? Is he not Igbo? You see that they are scammers. That's how God exposed them. When the Igbo presidency, they were shouting, came, did they come out? No. Right? Even Peter B was in court, they were congratulating to look. Promising to work with him on this. But then the Kano should stop. He want to destroy the chances of Igbo. He want to destroy the chances of Igbo. Chai, oh Nandekano, let him stop now. Igbo's chances to become president. 2019, isn't it? Now Igbo man come out 2023. Where are the Ohanes? Did you see them? These are very that's what we told you. IPOB cannot be shifted. We cannot be shifted. That's why when people were obedient, we are shouting. I never should join them. I told them to go and call Ohanes first. Let them join you. Call other governors. They should not, they should ignore party something. Let them follow Peter B. Then uh, we will now consider that you now need it. Not you, individual, who cannot die for Nigeria. You said the IPOB should leave what we have been dying for and join you on what you cannot die for. Can you die for Nigeria? How many of you can? All, have you not gone to bed? You cannot die for Nigeria. You want IPOB to live their first struggle and join you in your obedience. Which you cannot say, I will die. You can never die. You are just shouting as if you are youth. You don't have youth because your youth cannot walk in a country where you are a condemned criminal. Are you aware you are a condemned criminal as a Nigerian citizen? Why is it that you'll be moving on the road, driving on the road, you feel a new yes man would have crossed you, kidnap your wife, and you and the family, then in your presence, they'll be raping your, your wife, your daughter and your sister. Why now? Because you are all condemned criminals. Why is it that you come out in a junction, a checking point with your motorcycle, you did not give police 100 and they will shoot you? Are you not a condemned criminal? Why is it that you were protesting in Lekki, they, they shoot you? Because you are a condemned criminal. Why is it that you voted they did not count it? Because you are a condemned criminal. A condemned criminal cannot vote. But you voted, wanted it to be counted on your favor. Condemned criminal. There is, a, there is always a standard discharge in your country because you are a condemned criminal. Army can come to your community and kill you because you are a condemned criminal. Full and Hesman can invade your communities, massacre all of you, burn down your village, because you are all condemned. Now you see why your vote was not counted. Yet you are shouting, let us go and vote. How can a condemned criminal hold BVC and you sack the real citizens? Uh, the caretaker of the prison, no citizen. Nigeria have no citizen. Nigeria is a British prison, but there is no awaiting trial in that prison. Every citizen of that, every um, inmate in that prison are all condemned criminals. You can be shot down dead at any time. 
the government can disobey court order because you don't have right. You know, they see you as a con they know you are a condemned criminal. So if eventually they just want to go and prank you in the court, you know, Nigerian government they prank their citizens in court. They prank you. You think they are serious? It is prank. Taking you to court is prank because immediately they rule on your favor. Government will disobey. So they are pranking you. They will tell you it's a prank. It's a prank. We don't mean it. You know, it's a prank. We don't mean it. You know, going to Nigerian court is like they, they are prank. I, it's IPOB that feed them. Now, because you are a condemned criminal, you want to secure victory against the government. Why IPOB is fighting them? We are not fighting them with the name of Nigeria. You that is going to court with the name of Nigeria, fighting Nigeria with the name of Nigeria, you are a fool. We are fighting them with the name of Biafra. Now you see how why we are different. Now you see why you have no grant because you voted in the name of Nigeria. Are you aware? Nigerian youths, are you aware you are a condemned criminal? Are you aware that your president, the person claiming to your president, is Director General of Prison, Controller General of Prison, what they have in prison is Controller. Controller General of Prison is your president. Are you aware? Do you know that your governors are Deputy Controller of Prisons? They are in charge of state prisons. You know, those your governors are prison authority. They are governor and they are state assembly members. They are prison authorities. Are you aware? <laughs> so you think this is a country? A country where you will have sea, they will, they will shut down the seaport. Which kind of country is that? They will go and open dry land, dry sea in Kaduna and Kano. Are you not? Is, is that a country? That is a prison yard. Not a prison where you have a waiting trial because a waiting trial are free. Convicts, free. Life is also a convict, free. Condemned criminal. They have time to open them. They will open them 8 a.m., close them 1, 1 p.m. daily. Not outside the gate, inside the compound. Right? Uh -huh. So, but in Nigeria here, those that claim to be outside prison, they are now in Nigeria. That is where you see yourself in the main, the main prison. If you leave prison here, that come inside Nigeria. That's when you are the main, you are now in the prison. You can be killed. In prison, the main prison yard, you cannot be killed. But in Nigeria, as a freed man, you'll be walking on the road, police bullet will come and kill you. Or Fulani Hesman bullet will come and kill you. Or Army bullet, even civil defense will kill you. Navy, that's supposed to be in the ship. You see bullets from Navy, they kill you. On the land, you're not in the sea. Air Force will come to your community and start bombarding it. <laughs> no war. A government, governors can arrange and form a bubago to be killing you. And they kill you. Don't do anything because you are a condemned criminal. None of you. You think you're a citizen. You are a condemned. A bubago kill you. All of them kill you. Devil man, he killed you. Everybody he killed you. Okay, zip as They come out, they kill you. Uh, Obi are not killed you, you know. So Ludo is killing now. Obi Zalema is killed and he's killing. Rocha is killed, you know. You can come and kill. Uh, you, they are all condemned. We are all condemned. Condemned criminal. Come and kill. We get killed, you know. Everybody can kill. Tell me in, in a country where community can invade by terrorists, massacre them, and uh, small time, the government will tell you, give them your land. Give them your land for Ruga. Give, they say they are invaders. But they say give your land to invaders. Foreign invaders. Not even your fellow prison inmates. But foreign invaders. They come to kill you. Instead of government to stop them, they say, give them your land for Ruga. Give them your land for Ranche. Give them your land for, uh, what is it called? They, they, named, they brought about four names for this thing. IPOB destroyed it. So, let us go back. Those closer to true, 
should know that the file is empty file. Nobody should be doing gara gara as if there is anything you can do to Namikan. If Nigerians for grazing, yes, your land for grazing. And when I have Kaina Nube, I hear IPOB, I have a good grazing, ranching, go 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 go. It's a child, we are here, we are IPOB. I have a trap for you. If you are me, it's a child, we are here, we are here. I have a good one. 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 Eight years in Buaria plan of Charia from twenty twenty two last year. Who I can end up in a bakia die. And the lesson I carry go to Hasicho. I carry go to Hakari made lesson to Hasicho. Give myself, you don't even, you cannot even go for PVC. Right? Even a guy to vote one. You know, our resoluteness made them to make some wrong choices. Uh, but you don't know now. Just like the weapon we gave to Nigerian youth, they ignored it. Yunubu, Tinubu used it and become president. And that's why you can see I wrote him Bola, uh, Bola Tinubu, Nigerian president. He is their president, the very weapon of the death of Buhari. Now they can give it to them. These idiots, they call themselves youth. They were holding PVs as useless as they are against tyrannies and dictators. Mad idiots. The man who was wise, Tinubu, very smart man. When they wanted to do him like this, he grabbed that information from Namdekan. He said, I will talk. I will talk if you don't give me present, I will talk. They gave it to him. But this were weapon provided for this idiotic youth. This idiot that lies on envy. Idiots. You do give them cheap, cheap, that is cheap weapon. Namdekan was so far for. Instead of you to ask the government to explain, now I'm not becoming this invitation. You didn't. You are talking PVC, stop the agitation, get your PVC first, go and vote first. But Tinubu did not believe in that, your go and vote. He knew there is a weapon Namdekano provided. He leaked the secret of the death of Buhari. Now he used it to collect his president. And today you are jumping up, going to court. You are a fool. Envy and jealous. It will continue to deal on Nigerians. Because he came from IPOB in the camera. Then you will not use it. Today, they handed over with image that imposter have ruled Nigeria. You were there, they handed over. That government handed over. Imposter handed over. Tomorrow you come and stand in my presence to argue with me as a Nigerian. What are you talking? Do you have face? You, you will come on. Somebody that, for how many years? From 2017. You were there, they conducted the election again, they put in post. You refused to ask them to clear the image of Nigeria. That this allegation from Namikano have destroyed the image. Tell the president to clear the image of Nigeria, as, especially now Namikano is in detention. Let him prove to the world that he's alive. You were by it, he said PVC. I have you big PVC. I said PVC can wake a console. As if PVC can wake those killed in National High School. As if PVC can wake those killed in Nepal. As if PVC can wake those killed in OPU. As if PVC can wake those killed in Iwata. They mean those killed in Nepal. Those killed in Esenu, the Makwaibo. Those killed in Delta by Fanyo Kowas Commission of Police, Hafiz Mohamed Inua. His name cannot be forgotten. I can never forget that name. He kidnapped and killed so many are missing in Delta today. Hafiz Muhammad Inua, a Fulani man who killed us. Not mass murder, not mass killing, uh, but he, that is uh, not in a protest, that's what I mean. But he go house to house, pick, kill, pick, kill, pick, kill, pick, kill. That's what he was doing. Hafiz Muhammad Inua, right? Was the one who kidnapped Sunda Shaka. Three of us. <laughs> the Shaka was the least, and many of them missed. Thank you. Thank you. The water bill is for for Dokobo. <laughs> That's what Dokobo is uh, is fighting for. You know, you saw him. Hey, Tinubu, Tinubu, 
terrible because they promise him water bill without knowing that is that bill. Right? <laughs> water bill. Water bill. All right. We, we go there. So, what we are telling them is that there is no Nigerian citizen qualified to argue with us. Do you know why? They have been ruled by impostors and they refuse to prove us wrong. That is to say, they accepted it and they knew it is true that their president died. So they should not complain because the man who knows how to use it, make use of information, but I made it to know smartly make use of this information. When Fulani wanted to do what they planned, Stilovo said it's a lie. It's a lie. After all, you know his age. He can say it and die. That's what they consider. They consider his age, knowing that he can decide to say it and die. Whatever will happen, let it happen. And they shifted on the road. That's what we expected from Nigerian youth. To chase both to every other, them, even those that won a election now, they wouldn't have been here. Because all of them was informed. They would have run away and leave Nigeria for you. But you are there because now the Kanu said it and that POB said it. You ignored it. Today, where are you? Uh, in a bit of the Supreme Court, uh, we are waiting, we are hoping on the court. You are, you are a fool. You are an idiot. Say Nigeria youth. So, you want to remove the Muslim Muslim ticket? What is Boko Haram fighting for? So after Boko Haram and the uh, Five, which is the Boko Haram, right? Uh, after they have achieved what they need, the United say, they, what, did you not hear what Five said? They said, we will give the West the sense of belonging. What is the sense of belonging? Making a, a Tinubu president. So that Yoruba will think they belong. So that they will join to fight us. That is how they play it. To give them sense of belonging. So that they will join to fight. But IPOB have been on ground already. Did you understand? Uh, we have taken positions already before this uh, thing. You know, uh, not that one they brought our land here war without anything. Ojuku went and discussed with them. They just brought war here. Right? So we was on defense. And that's what we have been avoiding, defensive war. And that's what they want to push us. We refuse. They want to use it later. To bring defensive war in our land. They want to and Nigeria was sending army because you, you want to war in your land. They were sending army. Kamalunyan and Kiel war, where you got a loss. You that they fought in your compound, who will lose? And you think you are wise. Their land will become safe again. You are infiltrated, you bring war to us. Not will become safe again. Instead of you to take war to not, you are bringing it to their land. You are, you are, you are, you are, you are, you are just a. Uh, Doing the will of government, what we have, army cannot be proudly to do again. No, you can do it with the name of Biafra. You come and kill people, you know. The same thing army have been doing. You know, so they are now using some of you. Kill them in the name of Biafra. People will accept it, you know. But you are doing the work of the army anyway. And all of you are Nigerian army. That's how we take all of it. Enemy of the people. So, what we are telling them is to tell their government to free Namdekan, who have no case, who, who is not facing trial, who have been discharged, he, and he is seriously sick. Even the, his health condition only, if he is still in awaiting trial, he will be granted bail. But this one is not something of bail, he has been discharged. So it's not something somebody will be expecting. Let us carry on surgery on him. So even if he die, we will blame those that sign. It is not lie. It is lie. Not truth. It is a lie. He stands no tamper. No tamper. Don't tamper. No tamper. That is what Namdekano stands for. After the court appeal, court of appeal ruling. Don't tamper. Oh no. Thank you. I need to marry now. 
That is it. Like I said, I don't want to go much in the program. I wasn't even in a better position to broadcast. But we have we are already committed. You must broadcast. <laughs> it is a must to hence you are broadcast. You must broadcast. Those that are post, you must post. Those that are tip, you must do it. If you don't do it, they will know you are not doing it. And you will know you are not doing it. And you will not sleep well. If you are devoted to do this, you will not sleep well. You even whatever you are doing, you will know you are offending. You are already lacking. You are already lacking. In your wing, your wing is already leaking. You know? So that is why some of us, when they attack their um, social media platform or when they suspend them, it will be as if they have lost their gun. They are now armless. They are now, they don't have any weapon because they have something good to offer to the people through their platform. And that is why we are all committed. We are all committed. Only those that are not committed will not be active and they will be comfortable. That is why you will see some of us who have been here, but they are hiding and they are free to go and sleep at any time. You will not remember them because they are hiding. But you that have been active in this battle, when you are not there, people will also know that you are not there. And you yourself will know you are already fighting against the struggle. Because what we agreed is that we will fight on until victory is achieved. We did not discuss that after fighting. You go, you, you go on holiday, at least after four months you come back. After three months, I don't know who you are coming back to meet. You know, had everybody go for leave on four months, or four months or now what they are doing now is not clear. Let me rest first. No, after you come back, right to meet who those that understood what was going on. Had everybody decided to go and rest because they don't know, they don't understand, they don't understand what is going on. If you come back uh, to come. Uh, and meet, who will you meet? So that after four months, you have understood what is going on, right? You run away, after three months, you come back, uh, does it mean you have understood? We are now discussing Biafra. But when you stopped, uh, we was not discussing Biafra, okay? If it comes to the time when you don't understand what we are doing, you control your emotion. Within some time, we will reach to the stage where you will understand. If you cannot join in the battle then, you will choose the section. You make option. It is optional. Decide where you will be fighting from. Small town. That side, that level will be over. You will join back. But it doesn't say you, you ignore us, you abandon us, you go and sit down, you go and they don't know what they are doing, you know. They are doing as if you are different. They are doing. They are doing what they are doing. We are just like a rolling on just we are rolling, moving. You know, you may play it, it will not enter the post, it will go or hit it. So if you play ball night, you hit by you say I'm going out, I will no longer play. Or you play, you go over, you say I know, you know, I'm not playing. I'm not playing again and become weak. So if you are not playing again, if other players say I'm not playing again, that means they have won you. This is the mentality we don't need in this very battle. Hence, you have joined, we move. Now, if you are tired, you stop. Don't tell us that why you stop is because you don't understand what you are doing. You are tired, you are tired. When you we are not we wasn't tired, did you understand what was going on? Just that uh, you are tired, instead of you to go and sit down, you give an excuse, look for who to hold. I don't like what this man is doing. Or guy, if you are tired, you get out. That's simple. 
But you see partiality, you don't need it. Smarter you hide. Four months. Right? Five months. Smarter you come back. Uh -huh. You come and show. You come and show. Not that your account was suspended. You just do it like that. Then you log in account that you were not known with. New account. Your private account, nobody knows you. You start going to comment section. Start causing trouble. By then, you say, um, no, no, I'm not understand what they are doing. You will now use another figure, your another account, to come and be bringing addition out those things you had in mind, you wanted us to do. Because we don't do it, you will now use another account to be posting it. And people will not know it's you. Right? After you have tried four months, three months, you did not achieve what you wanted to do. You will not log in your original account and say, I am back. Some of you that does this to you, I am back, but you have been online with your other account. Fighting us. After fighting two months, three months, four months, five months, he did not get it. You will not come back. You will now log in and start chatting. Hey, Jaffa. Hey, Mandekana. I am here. I am Gidiba. Oga, we don't want it. Right? And we will continue to push this. Now become more defeat. Continue to campaign. Continue to be on legal. Uh, you continue to fight legally because of our stand is self determination. There will be no criminality in our struggle, no criminality, because when IPOB was formed is to build a new family, to teach our people the new life to live in Biafra. You will not lie, you will be truthful, you will be you're sincere. Though people at times exhibit their personal life, but that is not the life of IPOB, right? And that is why... If you exhibit it with the name of IPOB, you will be suspended or expelled because IPOB did not teach you such. That is your private life. If you want to live it, you go privately. Don't leave it when you are at the front or front line of the struggle. You will be suspended because they will target on IPOB. That IPOB do this, right? Mm -hmm. Anything you do, if they, you commit offense, your news will go far because you're an IPO. That's why there are sacrifices to pay, just like me now, in Biafra land and so many others. Some of us do not understand how to live here as frontline freedom fighters or well-known or those that are determined. One, you will, lost, you will be losing things every day. You will lose friends. It doesn't matter how important your that friends are. You will lose them. Do you know why? The friend cannot betray you. Uh, may, may not betray you. But uh, through discipline or the brother or the any of them, you know, as you are coming in closer, you don't know that the sister or the brother have something in common with the security agencies. You know? Uh -huh. You see that that your friend loves you, but those that will betray you, his brothers and sisters, who may give information that you are, they came and pick you. Your bro their brother wasn't that way. Right? That one is different. Occasion. You will lose many occasions. You might be going be apart. You will lose many of it. Right? If you are doing be a friend, hey, that one is trouble. Then, some of the arrests come from our wives. Some of the arrests, right? Uh -huh. Somehow, they expose us without knowing. They expose the husband without knowing. They expose us to their friends without knowing that their friend can also meet another person. You know, that is the problem. Now, in business, you will not collect your rights always. Hence, you are in their friend land. People will try, when they want to cheat you, come down. Not cheating, because you are in the struggle. You will not fight that thing. That's your money. 
you follow normal process, you know. You know, they want you to go to police, isn't it? Or for you to fight. If you fight, he will not say grand uh, as a grudges in his mind that he will report police, tell him you are doing. You understand? You know, not cowardice, so, but because of what is in your hand, I feel we don't want to use you now. Now, I lose money. There are some people, you are, I can't, okay, Nagai, but I will go. There are some people that will just come to tempt you, you know? Uh, there are the people that will go to police. But they want to have something grudges. They will say that this is what you did to them. They want to justify it before doing it. And they will always come to tempt you. Right? Uh, these are things we avoid. 1,800, I am 200. I am not going to be to I am not going to I am I Obrone no na struggle if you are not in struggle. Mbank ige kwejiria. But in on a struggle zero nya. Zero nya. Ada ne na tra that ten. Nya chi ege. On ige dria one five. Or kwa no like is over chung with ye nyegi. Ze on yamo. Ega na is rendia. Ana ba loss. Ana ba loss here. Na dia frana ne ya ba loss. Ana ba loss. Ana chupa naja. And a mess up a quacker, a and a mess up one in, and I have one wicked. A correct, yeah, some things. I just let make again a things end that I get a mad on that trouble. A lava, young and lava, you know, as a time on a struggle, a guy who peacemaker here. They treat your matter before anything. They raise your matter somewhere, treat it. People are going to watch. No, you are not that way. <laughs> so these are things, you know. One thing I just went to time, be our people in Biafra land. Some things Hannah Aga dodge, you know. Some of them too shit, but I teach her online, be out this addition. He got dodge. Not that na actual game again with the right, but there are things he gave me good avoid. First, first you go to first you go to first. You may avoid. Give we can have no affairs. Now, in our house also, information are not being about you. I need information. I need information. You need information. But when you ever believe it, you make grudges. Ever believe it, you hate it. Onya, I make money. I say in a struggle. I will only need it. Oh, you make a new bank and a bank kata makagi. You need information. Or can I pass? Like you are not type you big. You need information. Okay. Not type you big. Oh, feel be a fans. Can pass the information. Oga a member of Kumaka, right? Some of times, you have one hammer kage die. You have one hammer ne wonde a hammer aroda ate. But he have encountered you now. A man who is a very nice person. Don't you know now the kind of nice person? So he gets this man can struggle a one weekend. In a struggle, then he may say, "Me, I don't believe you. I'm a coroner." Make it sure, make it sure. Ne e ha in bring the government. Na biya falanda. Make it sure. Ne bring the government. Jana me. Only ne mezi gihe. Ya amana yoje megi. Some of our rest are in a which are some people in a hand with problem. Half road to Tanne and ha ge nyeri ge police. Oh ya wagana ya guap police in Benne. Ya wagana ya guap DSS in Benne. Some of these are rest one one. Cause ya. Something he gave set he gave the bar loss. Set law, Muta no ne win the go. Yeah, win, you no problem. Because of he secure all your people. Oh win the go. Every man I'm I'm giving a manage you by a drag in a women. Now they raise the matter when he bas. Even man I'm gonna give me gonna do the Afra Kukuna. Or number he ne we are now. We can make food now. Yeah, one and play one of my programs. Why am I again? I come on rubbish for. Why am I crawling rubbish? I will not have that song. We are coming around. 
Os bons não batem no nada. Já o na rede vai fazer ninguém. Não vai ser queitir. Mas para quem não lembra não. Para quem não me vai fazer ser nico. O homem diga o homem não me deleva o que é outra. É hein. É o que se na ali o que não tem nada a ganhar não. Não mo é o homem que não é que mo. Não é que é bom mo. Right. So em retir isso aí não vai. Em retir isso aí não vai. Before it take on an argument, it calculates off man. Now they are friendly. Some of the argument hand they raise, how much they don't so? As I have been here raise here, it can get you on. You got to go. How did they not go? So do part of this is he gave me a point. Correct you, my. My co worker can only work. Can only work. How can I strategize back for arrest? Right? And I own. Gina, you mad enough about loss? How about ya? How about your loss? Ega, about here. Loss, ega, about here. How you get to go on at Ega? Loss, ega, about here before. First you go do. First you go do. Friends, friends. Occasion. Occasion. You have to do Ega like that. 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 O tamo a no hear na dini ne muna hani me koin hama a mana a bi okesho. Ba ne bi do be slogu no, ayo mna a bi okesho. Ayo wa ni me komiti. Beta si stan na, ki wa mana inye mkad, na o bo, inye mwe yi me nye ki. Ige me me esfete e bi okesho na, na doka ni, 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 I did not publish it. My brothers had a hidden idea that I had run a hidden idea before my life had run a hidden idea. Right? I was telling you that I came here and said, "Can you not read? I am not. I don't read your hand. Then I am not reading your book with." So things are not one loss. Time, 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 time is up. Time is a Study time, right? I won't be able to get you big when you live around there. You condemn yourself there. Information there, they will not give it to you. They will not give it to you. You have already condemned yourself. So, minimize all your life. All of your friends now have to be any information. On how how much do to do you believe? Because don't do all my first. Can you imagine with the SS now talking about that? Because don't do all my information. Can you use your baton to mad naka? Some of now now talking information. Can you use your baton to mad naka? But all of you can do baton naka. They will regret this. They will worry you until you are with each other. Be afraid. Each other be afraid. He left Iran. He got me as trouble, but him upon him on it, him too trouble. He gave so good he has so royal issue. He not so good at different land. Every man I hang with, no man out at your garage so they just call the police. Why he gave so he so royal issue? Maria, I was just now happy. I was watching you about it. My can he judge agenda? I can. How he judge? Only he judge agenda. No one has trouble. No one has trouble. I just like cash. Ihe eno no makamado, jidea. Jidea. Noro mwegi, noro mwegi. Aupa anwa yi ayipi opi. Ndo nde man nebi lo mwa, anwa banka tayna anwa. Eji li aga agi na madu na akoya. Aupa ndi anga agi koya. Ande mwri ke, obote polisi na chinti deki. Onye anka information yunga agenaka. Information agenaka koya. A information agenaka koya, haa pasa arake ya. It was spirit. Eyotra, each day ye nye ndi mada aka, ine me kwenye ye, e me li anonwe yi ne me espet. Ne le fere yi anya mbufon, ne le fere yi anya, yu a ipi obi fami me mena biya flana, ne le fere yi anya, e so zi la mate e so ri anishi, o ya mene haji e jidon fot ni mani. People abya mwe te grudges, adiz le me ye ge ene ke ye, abya te le gina madi ibe, me ya avoid, me ine e me le gina madi ibe avoid, Hana e me grudges, hana acho, hama e ha grudges. 
Any opportunity to wait in a police, so you go be police. May I avoid it? I'm a loss here. I'm a loss here. Before again, not here. Yes, I'm with the kids, nigga, but I'm with him, nigga, man, for it. So I'll be run, I will run the program up here. Right? Thank you. Now, I can learn to turn out the match of my yama. In our church, 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 in Email church, in our church, in our Obu pains all over his body. He can sustain him. In here, I call Gorani. Obu is not ready to be afraid. Nobody can kill me. Are you? Can you? Are you? Are you Chukwu Abiyama? Only Chukwu Abiyama can kill me. But he told me three things, which I must avoid. If you avoid them, nobody can kill you. Chukwu Abiyama, he's still maintaining it. You say he will not take bribe. You say he will not lie. And you said he will not be afraid of any human being. If he can maintain these things, that nothing will happen to him. He's maintaining it. But we don't want him to be there. You have sustained him two years. To go there, my friend. You have suffered Nigeria. He himself has also suffered. For our sake. You can use other methods to suffer Nigeria. Free Nam they can. We know his detention is suffering them. Use other methods. There is nothing you cannot do. You have killed Buhari. You killed Mama Ndawara. You killed Abakiare. You killed Isa Funtua. Any other one that said they, they don't agree. You know how to do it. But what we ask you, Chukwu Abiyama, to free Namdika, let him go and treat himself. We never base, rely on anybody. We always hope on thee. And under your instruction, we are fighting. Continue to assist us. Continue to preside over every of our proceedings. And continue to preside over every of our um, applications filed on any table or before any government in the world. We do not have any representative there. Those that will go on our behalf, you will be in them. You have been, you have represented us, represented us in UN. You gave us ruling from UN Working Group. And we wasn't there, but you was there. The same thing you did in appeal in the court of appeal. You ruled on our field. Nareke Elena Rotutu. Because of the joy you have brought to us. For this time around, nobody expected that there would be voice or voices that will ever come from the East. But you have established it through IPOB. And it is a, joy, a thing of joy. But the last joy we want to have is to be in Biafra. But what we want now is to celebrate within Namdekan before going into Biafra. We know you will give us Biafra. But in Namdekan to be with us is what we ask thee. We have maintained the peaceful approach you have asked us to do. To go Biafra. Cut off the hands that is holding, them, holding him. Any new person that said he will preside over his illegal detention, strike that person dead. Do not spare anybody that will come and stand on top of the court rulings that decided Namdekano and they continue to keep Namdekano in order to exercise his power or to show that they are political leaders. Jugu Abiyama, strike those set of people and free Namdekano because before humanity, before the, before even spirits, Namdekano have defeated them. But we want you to perfect it to the sin of the whole world by freeing him from DSS. These things we have prayed in your name, Chi, Uku, Okike, Abia, Amara, Pro, Ime, Ihenile. We have prayed. He said, He said, He said, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
from me. Shall I say you be better is Mazamara Chimachuku and from here our homeland radio Biafra. It is good evening.